Due to geochemical and climatic reasons, the Finnish soil is lacking selenium. Finland used to have a high incidence of uh, animal diseases because of uh, low selenium levels. They had heart problems and other heart diseases. Livestock were suffering of uh, muscle diseases, cows were weak, they hardly could walk. There were many problems. It was understood that also human diet was lacking selenium. Selenium is very important for the antioxidant defense system. There's a number of proteins, about 25 different proteins in the human body, which are dependent on selenium. Back in the 1980s, a group of experts were collected to uh, consider the dilemma of how to provide enough selenium to Finnish people. Yara at that time was invited to the group to represent crop nutrition expertise. They were curious to learn how to make selenium available on a daily diet and they went to the root of food. Fertilizers are an excellent vehicle for bringing selenium to the entire population because if people just eat supplements, it won't be evenly distributed, it won't benefit the entire population. When the cow is eating the grass, the selenium is transferred furthermore in the food chain to milk, to meat, and all the products that consumers are eating. And that provides sufficient amount of selenium to us. Mikko Leikola, and now we are in Millala, Hereford cattle farm here in the southern part of Finland. We are having about 100 Hereford cows and we are producing young bulls for our neighbor and also some new suckler cows for other farms. We have used Yara fertilizers all my farmer lifetime. The fertilizers are giving some of those minerals what we don't have, like nitrogen. We use the selenium sulfide on this farm. So if the fertilizer doesn't have the extra selenium for our fields, then our cattle don't get it. The selenium example is a fantastic one. It's an example of what we can do by adding minerals into the food chain how we can impact the human health by providing the right nutrients to people.